everybody. My name is Markiplier. It's currently 3 a.m. because I woke up early and I'm still on Cincinnati time. My roommates are still asleep, so I decided that I was going to record a Let's Play and make it the world's quietest Let's Play. It sounds like there's pop rocks in my mouth because I have the sensitivity turned up so high in my microphone. And I thought, what better game to play for the world's quiet? I'm just going to turn that a little away from me. There we go. That's probably better. So I thought, what better game to play for the world's quietest let's play than Happy Wheels? And now I will move on to a sword throw where I will murder these sons of bitches. Eat a dick, little Johnny. Eat ten dicks. Why the fuck did that happen? You son of a bitch. I will eat your face. Once more under the breach, my friends. Remember, pain is only a temporary measure. Lady, are you flirting with me with the boon up your butt? Because I don't take too kindly to that. Also, I just noticed the lady showing me her vagina. That's inappropriate. An epic big ball throw. Because if there's one thing that Markiplier likes, it's epic big balls. I unlocked the win. And I received another ball. An odd medical condition to have an extra ball, but one that I will not complain about because I'm a winner. What? I, I'm not ready for a rope swing. I was not told that I was going to be doing a rope swing. I'm pretty sure this was not part of my contract, and frankly, I hate everything you stand for and everything that you are. Frankly, I believe that this is a load of bullshit and I wish nothing but hell to rain down upon these stupid ass balls and everything to go wrong in their life because I hate them and I am left with just one ball to my name. Sounds a lot like my life. I have two testicles. Suffering is all you will get in this universe. <laughs> Suffering is all you will get in this area. Suffering is all you will get because I don't know how to fucking talk. No! Oh my god. Fuck me in the butthole. It sounds a lot more sexual when I say it this close and this quietly. Fuck me in the butthole. But not seriously. Like in a ragey way. <sighs> oh. You all need to be much quieter. I am murdering you because you are not quiet. You are not quiet and you need to be quieter there is too much at stake here my roommates could wake up and lego will start barking lego's not quite as good to no. <laughs> no morpheus i know kung fu i also know watermelon food for some reason and i survived because i'm no, don't fuck the melon. Whenever I say something like this, it sounds very sexual. Do not fuck melons, but, you know, fuck the melon. Not like that. Not like this. Not like this. Another kung fu fight. I gonna kill you. Well. <laughs> Mercy. Shall not be. Well, fuck me. Prepare. To eat a dick. <laughs> Lastly, I shall attempt this rope swing bullshit. That's a good enough way to end this as anything. So thank you everybody for joining me for the world's quietest Let's Play. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you're having a wonderful morning. Because I'm going to be awake for a long, long time by myself. Thank you everybody so much for watching. And as always, I will see in the next video. Bye bye. I'm not gonna do it. Hello everybody. My name is Markiplier and welcome back to the world's quietest let's play. I thought to myself when I was meditating this morning, what better way to test out the capabilities of this new room than with another world's quietest let's play.
floof the hair for power. So let's get started. Oh, look. It's another big ball throw. Not as big. And I like them big. You sack of crap. But the chances of you getting the correct spot are very slim. No, you bag of tits. You son of a bitch. How dare you mash my face? If I have to do this bullshit again, I'll tear off your entire ass and then feed it to yourself. Ah, uh, the center square. The possibilities for victory are endless and you have just fucked yourself. Watch and weep. Victory is assured. There is no way that I can fuck this up. I am the greatest to ever exist. Come along, little Johnny. It has been a while. I hope you don't mind the bumpy ride that we're going upon. Johnny, come back here, you little shit. Once more, under the breach, repelled by who I thought was once my friend. Wow. It seems I've found the secret to suck. Come with mommy, little children. Little Johnny, stay there. It's... Uh, okay, goodbye, Susan. Susan made the right call. Huh. Well, I suppose this is better than actually trying. Now, little Johnny, if you could just... I did not go. That was not me. I take great offense to this. And I believe you owe... Me. Well, never mind. Thank you. If you could stop pooning my butthole. What did I just say? Ooh, five balls. It seems my medical condition has worsened by a factor of two. Point five. I don't like that. No, 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 no. <laughs> my vengeance will be endless. You will see horrors on you sack of fuck. I'm gonna catch it. I caught it. <laughs> no. I'll catch it. <laughs> Duh. It's me. Duh. It's me. Sid. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this kind of voice. No. No. You bastard kitty. When I get out of this ball. This next one, I will officially stop hating on you. Little Johnny. Have a nice day. Hello, everybody. My name is Markiplier, and welcome back to the world. Quiet. Let's play. My mic is at its most sensitive setting. I have to be exceptionally quiet this time. It's currently 
5.58 a.m. And my stepmom, who's visiting, is in the other room. So, it's time once again to play quietly. Oh, I'm sure that whatever the hell is over that blind ledge is going to be both fun and educational for my guy here. Oh God. I don't think my character has any more bones to break. And here, you can see the face of imminent regret. Here, the spine has erupted into shattered pieces. The pelvis exploded into various meaty bits. I know that as a cool happening dude, I think I can... I think I can still survive this one. There's a pop. Thank you for returning my skateboard to me. Oh, my good friend, the boogie bus. Please, ow, boogie bus. <laughs> the boogie bus betrayed me before I was even doomed. Please, you don't have to do this. No. I'm sorry. <laughs> you got what you deserved, you bus b Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> the boogie bus came back for revenge. Ah, yes. The sweet serenity of a phallic-shaped rocket. This level is called Kerbal Dismount Program. And I'm certain. I hate everything you stand for. We need to ascend. Oh, goodbye, car. What we need now is boosting, maybe? Question mark. We've done it. We've made it. Is this space? Are we in space? Oh, no, wait, let me, uh, yeah, I was wrong. Where's my car? I know where it went. If we wait, oh, so patiently, there we <laughs> I don't know why that was really funny to me. Hello, darkness, my old friend. It's good to see you here again. Turbo Dismount has been so lonely without you, and you'll always be with me. Me. And here we see the elegant ballerina train. Preparing for her big debut. What, what a what a beautiful <laughs> <laughs> You guys don't know what I'm laughing at? Probably. <laughs> but hang on, let me set the scene for you. Now you tell me if this doesn't look like a dick suddenly popping the tunnel <laughs> and then being slapped repeatedly <laughs> <laughs> okay okay all right okay i'm glad to know that my level of maturity has if anything decreased over the years since the last time i played turbo dismount thank you guys so much for watching 
Another World's Quietest Let's Play. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Hello, everybody. My name is Markiplier, and welcome back to another World's Quietest Let's Play. Now, you may know my personal history with I Am Bread. It is a game that deserves to be flayed alive on the sacrificial altar. However, I've received word that the development team has made a slightly less stupid way to control your inanimate bread. We've added a fresh new control scheme called Gamepad Basic. This will make your bread a little easier to control in case you were finding it too frustrating. So, I'm going to take this in with a modicum of love. And we will see. Oh, we will see what we can do. What the fuck is Bagel Race? Oh no. I remember. I remember now why I abandoned you. Let us. This looks just as stupid as it was before, okay? This is literally just as bad as it once was. Oh, the memories are flooding back into me. Oh, the horrors of which my past has haunted me. You ch oh no. There comes a time in everybody's life when they must sacrifice for the greater good, and this is not that fucking time. Don't worry, little controller. I won't break you unless you deserve to be broken. Same goes for all of you. Let's continue on our path. So long as we think the most peaceful thoughts in the world, we will be okay. We can persevere through- what are you even- how is that even what I want you to do? Now just flop your stupid floppy body over this yonder way. And if you fuck up- oh, you fucked up. You fucked up, here comes a stabbing. I need you to question everything you have ever done in your life. Closely enough, you can hear the anger neurons firing inside my brain. I'm a man of considerable patience, and you bred. I don't care how many fingernail clippings, I don't care how many band-aids, how much AIDS you have on you. I will eat you. I will eat all of you. Not you guys. I'm thinking that maybe... Maybe I haven't activated the new control scheme. And then if there was... No, I was on... I was on Gamepad Basic. These are literally no different. There's... There's nothing different about this. Okay. That is the way that life is. We can beat this. We can beat this. Because I believe in me. Who believes in you? And if we believe in each other, maybe we'll go shut the fuck up. What is that? What is that? What is that glowing glory over there? Could it be something that's going to save me? I don't know what that did. Oh, it gave me grip. Grip like the gods. Grip like the gods that's not going to help me if it's just going to be stupid like that. My edibility is 100%. Wait, did it feel pity on me? <laughs> did it feel pity on me? and decide to give me what Nintendo gives you when you fail a level too much. The golden tanuki soup. That's what this is, isn't it? 
I see your game. Why is it so hard to crawl over a pair of pants? They are a simple, elegant creature's pants, but you can just get the fuck over it and move your bread ass over there. This is the life. There we are. Now we're... I don't care if this is pretty much cheating at this point. <laughs> My bread seems to have grown some fur, but that's okay. Because I, who am not cheating... Oh, why am I going... Why am I going... Why am I stuck to the underside of this? <sighs> you guys don't understand how much I literally hate this game. There is nothing I feel inside my soul for this fucking game. <sighs> ah, slow and steady wins the race. Slow and steady gets you punched inside the face. I am a golden god. If I don't get toasted in the light, then where do I go? There is a freaking heat iron right there. Is it on? I don't think it's on, but I'm going to get my bread ass slid in those slots. get to the top of that dresser and then throw my bread body off of it. Excuse me, breathing like a beast in your ear. It's the only thing I can do to stay sane. Mm, flailing wildly, I see. Something I am very accustomed to in the middle of the night. Ha <sighs> ha. Things are looking up for Markiplier, if you know what I mean. That means I'm going up. This seems impossible, and yet I have done... There we go. I can do this. Excuse the most pathetic launch I've ever seen in my life. If you... I saw my life flash before my eyes. I saw everything that I knew in love. I saw everything that I knew and loved being destroyed in front of me. <clears throat> okay. I just have to get on this goddamn toaster. Do you see the arduous bullshit that I had to go through just to get to this one point? How in the flip-flop and floop doop and world would I have ever gotten there on my own? Just a little bit farther. If I just hang like here, floating like a flag in the wind, taunting and flaunting my victory to everyone around me, I will get a lovely, even toasting. Honey, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? Why, 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 why? I ask you, I beg you, I call to the heavens. Why, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? Just stop, just be to- Hold yourself before I wreck you. Self, you yourself, you, I wreck you. I will, I will literally kill you. I got one side done. Get off. It's okay. It's all right. I got something that you gon' like. Let go of the shard. Let go of the corner. Hey. I closed my eyes for one second and you tried to betray me. We have reached the precipice. And you get 
tin to that iron, and you cook in the fires of hell. I hate you with every fiber of my being. Why have you stopped toasting, friend? Host like the bastard you you are. Mm. I have done it. I am victorious. I am the greatest breadmaster to ever walk the earth, and anyone who disagrees with me shall be punished severely. With that being said, now I can bury this game in the annals of history, not the annals of history, the annals with two ends. And let it be forgotten and lie dead in the ocean where it belongs in prison down there with chains unbreakable. So thank you everybody so much for watching and thank you for joining me on another world's quietest let's play. Let me know what you think down in the comments below and... As always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Hello, everybody. My name is Markiplier, and welcome to another world's quietest Let's Play. Although, the elegance of with which I play these games will be countermanded by the fact that we are going to be playing Getting Over It by the eminent douchebag known as Bennett Fawdy. Now, as we peruse the world of Mr. Cauldron Man, keep in mind, I will not scream. I will not rant. I will not rave. I will not allow myself to become the debased asshole that you all know Markiplier to be. I will not be stopped in my quest. Shut up, Mr. Foddy. Leave me to my own devices as I climb up this mountain of bullshit that you have created. You know what you've done to deserve all the hate that you receive, and yet you stand like a titan among the mountain and you stare down. Ooh. I am entirely happy with my predicament because I am a paragon of virtue and I know exactly what it takes to be the one who succeeds when all others fail. And you will see. You will see the inside of your entrails when I drag them out of your abdomen and show them to you. Mr. Cauldron Man, if you even have legs, I'll be certain to rip them off and replace your arms with those legs for all the good your arms are doing you right now. Excellent. This is a representation of my sins and you will be purged in the fires of absolute. You will be purged in the fires of absolution. Along with all of your ilk, I will burn the heretics that you are harboring inside of your soul. I will destroy you. I will never allow you to survive. I will never. I will just breathe. Everything is calm, peaceful, rainbows, sunshine, and butterflies. <gasps> I am a deflating balloon of anger. I am a hot air balloon of sass. And you will not prevent me from achieving... <sighs> from achieving my ultimate victory, I will not allow you to be the one that... See what happens when you obey me. Success rains down upon everybody. The long, weary road of success is paved with failures, and I will not be a.
the tea's ready. I've seen your browser history, and I am not impressed. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. I can. <laughs> I know an impossibility when I see it. An impossible is written all over the face of this game. Spilling over it. I passed a kidney stone. Please listen to me once more, you sack of poopy. I am a calm, peaceful man with calm, peaceful intentions. Who is going to get through this? with strength of mind and strength of soul. Nope. 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 <laughs> no, 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 I see what you were doing and I will not allow it. I will take this patiently and I will take this graciously because I am a gracious patient man. I am the graciest, patientiest man ever known to the face of the ages. Hat, help. Hat, you betrayed me just like everyone else. You will burn the fires of my own hell. I will choose your pain to last eternity. Hat, do not betray me. Get out of here. You will know everything that is... The <laughs> I have clung to deeper convictions than you will try to wrest from my soul. Ah. Uh. Right. Just as I planned. Excellent. I have reached the mountain, the zenith, the aperture, the epicenter. Everything has led to this moment, and I will not be dissuaded, not by my phone, not by this mountain, not by the things that are trying to stop me. Nothing will get in my way. Not this final zenith, this final moment. This one unquestioning obstacle will stop being douche and will obey. It will obey every undulating face. No, 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 no. Alas, I leave you now to go slumber amongst the ancient. Thank you again. And as always, I will see you in the next video.